this is unlike any other Jesse Lopez vlog episode I've done before. You see, today we are in the village of Parkstein, the dormant volcano Parkstein. But you see, there's a very serious problem. Initially, we came up here just to explore and check out this village of Parkstein. But on our way up here, we felt some paranormal activity. So I am personally calling this an emergency investigation to see what is haunting this place, what spirits lie here, and what is preventing us from having a nice family Sunday. Around a volcanically formed hill, which is 595 meters above sea level, is the village of the same name, Parkstein. At one time, a castle, Parkstein Castle, stood on the summit. The Parkstein is famous for its impressive basalt outcrop. This basalt formation consists of pentagonal and hexagonal columns up to one meter high whose shafts extend into the earth to a depth of up to 30 meters. Situated on top of a basalt outcrop and looking over the sweeping valley below, Burg Parkstein was once a magnificent castle of unknown origin, which was inhabited since at least the 12th century. The structure was damaged during the Thirty Year War and was eventually razed to the ground with a beautiful chapel now taking its place. It remains one of the longest and most brutal wars in human history with more than 8 million casualties resulting from military battles as well as from famine and disease caused by the conflict. heard a voice of a woman. I just, I I was trying to go up the, the castle and all of a sudden I heard a voice of a woman as if she was calling me. So this means only one thing. We need to record what was calling out to me and the only way to do that is with an electronic voice phenomenon, otherwise known as an EVP. All right, let's start the EVP. Listen, we mean you no harm, but I find it kind of funny that on our Sunday, our family Sunday, checking out this castle, you would come out and you would reach out to us. What is it that you want to tell us? Oh my gosh, we caught something. Let me play it back to you. Let me play it one more time. It sounded like they burned the castle. They burned the castle. Oh, come this way, come this way. There it is, there it is. These rocks, they... Someone moved them, they were here before. This was intact. Someone has moved these rocks in the last minute or so since we've been here. I was just contemplating after taking a pee of what has just happened here. It leaves me no choice but to pull out the next weapon. And that is our EMF ghost detector. Let's turn it on. Already picking up something. Follow me. Okay, watch your step, guys. EMF detector is basically your electric and magnetic field ghost detector. It's very easy to pick up invisible energies, often referred as radiation. I think it's picking something up. Here we go, here we go. It's getting close. I think I figured it out. I had 
COVID already, by the way. Oh, I think that was a spider web. Try this. I felt this presence and I got so lightheaded. Yeah, I'm just so glad that the, the backpack, it broke my fall and, and it wasn't so bad. But I think there's something here, something here that we need to take a look at. I've almost have scared it away. Let's keep going up the castle. There's a the church. I couldn't find anything up on top of the uh, where the castle used to be, the, the now chapel. We're gonna head on down at the bottom, see if we can detect anything. video we captured a ghost telling us that the castle had burned and guess what upon research a simple google search into the city's archives i discovered that ghost was right once upon a time castle hill the castle here was burned down by an evil brother so the question is is this story true or did we just invent it i'm jesse lopez reporting from parkstein germany until the next time.